Good evening, good afternoon, good morning. Johnny V coming at you with another video. And uh, this one's for our uh, good friend Peter at PB Retro Restorations up there in Queensland. Uh, celebrating his fourth year on YouTube. Congrats, Pete. That's, uh, that's a good effort. And you really do put out the product. And we all appreciate that greatly. Uh, Entertainment-wise and instructional. You might not think so, but you definitely got it there. So thanks again, Peter. Um, we're invited to build a Corvette. Any media, any scale, even coffee stirrers. Hmm. Anyway, this is what I got for you. Thanks, guys. The AMT 53 Corvette, first series Corvette. It's a, it's a good car, and it's a, an ordinary kit, sadly. Um, it was good to build, but it has its issues, and I'll describe some of them that I struggled with. Just so if you want to build it, you might be able to resolve those when you do. But here's the car finished. It's, uh, it looks good. It, it, it really does. It represents that little model and that car very well. Uh, it's just got problems with the body fitting over the chassis and, and some of the stuff around. But I'll point that out to you. But there we are, guys. It's there in all its glory. And it's tr traditional white and burgundy. And um, we had the pearl steering wheel and the uh, background for the dash in white. And then interior-wise for the engine, we got a straight six there. Uh, Colour coordinated to the actual builds of the real car. And the triple carbies. And that's about all the detail that's under there, unfortunately. There's not a lot unless you really went to town with aftermarket stuff but one of the problems I found was if I back back enough the ride she is, sits like a gasser and no matter what you do at the front end you can't get that to drop down so I struggled and um, that was one of the problems the other problem I found was here in the front where the uh, lower valance meets the upper guards once that grill's in place, they just don't fit. And I filed both top and bottom and even around the grill and I still couldn't get it to mate up. So anyone wielding this kit would have to do some pretty aggressive filing, I think, to mate that up perfectly. Uh, but guys, I'm happy with it. it uh, those overriders seem to sort a bit of, the, bit of the problem out. But for me and... Uh, for my cabinet, this one's fine. Um, I'm happy with it. But Peter, I hope uh, it happies, happies you, makes you happy. And uh, thanks again for your uh, invitation into the Corvette build and for your four years, mate. Um, good effort. All right, guys, this is Johnny V saying keep well, keep safe, and we'll catch you again. Bye now.